Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sandra, if you have not been here before. And today we are going to look at my weekly setup for my planner. I'm in my Franklin planner. This is my sky blue Olivia. Not thinking clearly yet because um, I woke up at, well, it, it's after seven now. So my, my son actually has to be woken up for school here in, in a sh few short minutes, which I definitely slept in. I was supposed to get up at five, I slept until 5.30. My baby woke up at the same time, which is just tragic because it ruined my entire morning. I fed him and then I just fell back to sleep until like 7.12. So um, things have definitely not been going the way that I planned. So, um, so much for following my plans in my planner. We're going to get her done. There might be a few more noises later on because I'll be filming this later in the day. It is what it is. And uh, let's, let's get to it. So I'm going to open up my binder. Yep, I know. <laughs> she won't even hardly close. There's a few things I can take out of here right now because I do have some dailies for the end of May. Um, I just put everything in here, guys. It is a full um, bigger than the last binder that I had. I have added everything in here. So I've got my personal, my catch-all and my work stuff all together. And despite how much I want to downsize, it just never happens. I did downsize. I went from two binders to one binder, but as you can see, it's, uh, we're, we're <laughs> at capacity for sure. All right. So I have task cards, Actually, did I keep my other task cards in my old folder? Let's see. Okay, so despite not even really following these, I don't even know what happened to my monthly one. Um, despite not really following these, I had to take this out because I ran out of room in here. So I'm going to be putting my t new task cards here in the pockets. However, the only ones I have right now are the monthly, or the, sorry, my work ones. These are from my work binder. So I was going to make new ones and I ran out of time before these videos were being created. So I either have to make new ones or I'll see what, you know, what I can get out of these two here. So this is technically for, for work. First step, reviewing my goals. So um, you can see I've changed my pen. I'd set it to downgrade for this month to, um, and my fountain pen is just so heavy. Um, I will be using it in my Hobonichi. I just haven't been using it. It's nice to go to a regular pen, actually. It's it's a lot lighter. This is from Cloth and Paper. Um, yeah, it's just nice. So, um, first, <laughs> go to goals. Um, and we'll look at May. I mean, this is technically the last week of planning for the last week of May and then the first few days of June. So it's kind of hard to, um, well, I mean, here you can see it. So we're looking at the 29th to the, th uh, the Sunday, the 4th, 29th to the 4th. So I, I kind of hate weeks that fall like this. And this is why I always post my monthly first. So you can kind of see like June laid out before I get into the first week of June, because this is completely like one of those middle months, right? Um, middle yeah like you're stuck in between a planning week I like it when it ends like on a Sunday or something where the new month starts on a Monday um, but yeah so everything here is crossed off so everything that I had planned um, this is happening today actually my mom's appointment so everything that's happening has happened or I didn't do it so the art project didn't get done the hot water tap didn't get put in and yeah, everything else happened. I didn't actually have that many goals. The biggest goals were um, Swedish Death Cleaning the Basement, which I, you know what? I've been in this new mindset about minimization. Just every time something is no longer useful or no longer has a purpose or no longer has a spot, it's done. Or if we bring something new into the house, we have to exchange it with something else, which is not so hard for me, but it's hard for my husband. So I think what happened? Oh, they're talking about something and I can't remember what it was and they said if you bring that in or if we buy it something else has to go so um, it was a little difficult for him so for the first week of June I don't think any of this is relevant except for some of my goals um, 
the, the changing routine isn't relevant until the end of the month when my son is done school. Um, I guess the one that is actually, which will be this week, is on Thursday. So I'm glad it happens on Thursday. Um, I will be filming my weekly plan with me on that Thursday. So that actually will be a busy day because that is my analytics day and then also my budget close day. So I will be looking at these two for the first. Um, I want to do closer expense tracking, just try to follow our budget like more. Um, I don't have to do any of this stuff yet. So another big focus is maybe clean my Jeep again, clean the garage, even if I just sweep it out. And then also just keep on the Swedish death cleaning. So I've got weekly organization. So just picking a spot in the house, going at it once a week, finishing the basement, doing the basement landing and going through my son's clothes and also the baby blankets. I need to get that done. Uh, and then just continuing doing the meal planning and tracking and especially percussions. That's one of the things I want to work on the most. And actually, even though I'm tracking health and stuff, another one I really want to work on is water intake. I find that I'm drinking way too many sugary drinks and not enough plain water. So I would pick like flavored water over regular water. And then it's just kind of holding me back, I feel. So I need to change my drinking habits. <laughs> drinking habits. I promise I don't have a drinking habit. Um, all right. So next let's go to the, oh, now we have two task cards. But well, this is like a progressive task list. Um, these are literally tasks that I need to do um, for my business. So, and those are all business things. Uh, but we'll go to the compass card. So we're going to review it first and then we'll make a new one. So for review, um, so yeah, you'll see I've got the last few days of my Agendio inserts in here for May. So I went right up because I noticed in my seasons inserts, they don't start until June 1st. So it doesn't care that because like obviously if I kept with the seasons, they would have been Wednesday. May 31st on the previous page, right? But they don't care that the start of the week is um, Thursday. It doesn't have the previous week. So I'm going to have to plan using the the weekly one, the Teresa Collins that I'm going to use. But I just have the last few Agendio inserts in here. So it does have the weekly dashboard, but I'm not going to use that because I'm going to be planning on the Teresa Collins ones. All right. So right here so water dentist both of those still working on it journal I have been journaling my heart out human design this is another goal that I want to accomplish I didn't actually set that goal for the month um, I really want to so I should have added that on there because human design is one thing that I really want to study especially in regards to myself right now I just literally don't have the time and it's um, kind of making me frustrated because that's one of the things like when there's something that you really, really want to do and you're like, Oh, I just wish I could do it right now. And then you don't. And you're like, why? Like, why can't I just make the time? But I literally can't. I've got between three kids and all my obligations and keeping the house somewhat tidy. It has been so difficult to find time to even have a shower, let alone study human design. So um, I'm going to keep it on my list because I still want to. Tarot Oracle I did last week. Um, so I, we were driving home on Monday and I ended up doing that on Tuesday. So all of my catch up stuff, I was already kind of late this week, like, you know, f doing work because I had Monday as still a holiday. And technically for me, it's still a work day, but I forgot that I had to, you know, schedule my blog on, on Monday and um, do all of my journaling stuff. So none of that stuff happened until Tuesday. So for CEO, changing it up, I have definitely changed it up. I will be um, this binder. All my work stuff is in here as well. Everything's kind of integrated now. Um, set up compact. I will be doing that right after this video. You guys will see it. Website update, haven't done. In Classic Monthly, we did that already. 
Okay. Um, artist setting up binder. Yeah, I did. Although it's not as pretty as my last binder, I feel like it's definitely more functional. The pockets aren't quite the same as my vintage Aurora. So it's not like I've got a few decorative elements, but most of it's for functionality and holding stickers because I have no place to put my stickers. <laughs> so, um, and the binder is so big that I can't put my stickers in that little pocket. Um, I do have the stickers I use my planner quite frequently here and it's not going to fit. It's My binder's already too full. So, um, but I have set up the binder. Call Tressa. I have to still do that. I haven't done it yet. Um, wife, so support that's been given. Movie, we watched a movie. The last movie we watched was The Other Guys and I fell asleep. So I did fall asleep, but the next one will be technically the next one like on here because this goes till Sunday. This also would have been date night because we have date night on Friday night. Okay, mother, schoolwork, patience. <laughs> patience has been hard to haunt to be harnessed. I'm I'm not I'm gonna be honest here. Um to, yesterday was especially trying. For some reason, I don't know why. My kids were psycho. I have no idea. And yesterday was a very challenging day for me. Um so I've been trying, but you know, <laughs> schoolwork. I feel like like we've been haven't been reading as much as as we should and I think it's just we know it's almost June we know it's almost the last month of the year my son has no um get up and go he doesn't want to go to school every day it's a fight it's like mom I don't want to go to school and I'm like you have to go to school and it's been a constant fight it's been very very challenging for me um because again I'm fitting in his school work so I help him study I listen to him read I help him with his words I've been having to do this amidst all of the other work that I have and the other kids and just everything. So it's been very hard. I have been doing it though. Um, daughter, time together. So we've had, my, me and my mom have had time together. And as a learner, human design, not. Face-to-face -face video, I started that on, I posted my first one on Wednesday. That video definitely wasn't the best. So I apologize for the quality there because I was driving home from Red Deer. I do have a Jeep Wrangler and it is bumpy as all, you know what? Um, it was raining too, which I mean for us it's good because right now we have severe fires or we did anyway, I'm not sure about now, but we definitely need rain. Like we need rain so much right now. So anyway, um, the video quality will definitely improve for next week. I'll be filming that video this Saturday. Blog brainstorm, I need to still keep that on because I'm going to be doing that next for next week. All right. So I will be integrating more of um, my work and my business tasks on here. So again, CEO, I might add admin um, on here. I want to add learner again because I like that. But um, the blog brainstorm can go under under work um, and the human design can go. It should just stay under here because this is something that I really want to work on for me. So I'll get rid of learner and just put admin because I'll have CEO, which is my business, and then admin, which is business tasks outside of like my business. <laughs> All right, so we're going to set new goals now. That is right next to my reviewing the, t the goals. And I know I have new compass cards in my goal section. Okay, <clears throat> so I'm going to quickly do this and we'll be right back. I want you more than money. I want to float on downstream. Go and find my wild dreams, yeah. I'd kill to feel it all shake you like a twisted mind game. I'll be burned by your flame. Oh. Ups and downs, no in between. Fire and ice, burn gasoline. You know I love it. You know I love it. Love and hate, romantic sin. Fire and ice, gone with the wind. You know I love it. Okay, 
Okay, so I threw the other one out. So my new um, my new compass card, because I want to do Lush Shutter. That's one of my goals for this week. Um, social Emotional for, is journaling. These are for my um, Sharpen the Saw. This is for me. Mental is Human Design. I really want to focus on that. And Spiritual is Tarot Reading. Okay, so right now for admin for business, I only have update website, um, but I will probably add update Facebook page on here. Role as CEO, notes for face-to-face -face vid. So I didn't actually put do face-to-face -face vid because I don't want this to be a glorified task list. I just want it to be like, these are the things I need to be able to succeed in doing the other things. So update website. Oops, I already did that. <laughs> Notes for face-to-face -face video, blog brainstorm, and keep planner organized. Okay. For wife, mom, time outside together, um, slash barbecue, I want to put, because um, it will be nice. Movie night, homework, and meal planning. So that will, you know, kind of affect all of us. For friend, I need to call my friend. Artist, lettering practice, and get that cross-stitch project finished. And then home, Swedish death cleaning, and minimize. And then also maybe on the weekend, attack the basement landing. That has been on my radar for a long time. So I really want to get that done. Okay, so that is it for my compass card. For all of my big rocks. And my... Um, rolls and stuff. So next we are looking at um, the calendar. We'll check the inbox, the tasks for the month, and we'll look at the calendar. Okay, and then I can schedule the new week. I'll be doing the new week in the Teresa Collins, which is new for me again because I haven't done that in a long time. So we'll uh, tackle that together. So let's, I guess we're here. So let's just look at the inbox first. Um, and then I'll just kind of think of things to try to add to my list. So human design, I definitely want to do that. I still want to focus on my die cuts for more, my, my uh, sticker shop. Um, I haven't even asked my mom if she set up her bookshelf yet. have to definitely make dentist appointments. Cross stitch thing. Um, King pictures, get the air conditioner. Oh, so many things. Um, Chad's bait side of the basement, go through the old paperwork, haven't finished it. The landing, maybe able the boxes, deal with the blankets, and Logan's clothes Have to go through Logan's clothes again. Pretty sure all the ones I have up in my bedroom for him are small again. Okay. So then we'll take a look at the calendar for May. So I guess we'll be looking at May and June because really, here we are. So I've got budget on Wednesday. So I'll still be doing the budget. I just don't, I'm not posting that anymore. Right. And then we find June, if I can remember where I put everything. And the first couple of days here, I'm actually just going to write in budget because I don't want to forget. So I did write in the last few days of May on the June calendar. Budget. Okay, so that's pretty much it. So I'll be doing the grocery shopping on the Sunday. Budget, um, early dismissal for my son, payday, movie night here, take out the recycle and take out. So, and then Saturday. Oh, the other thing I forgot to put on, on these is um, swimming. So we're trying to go swimming every Sunday at least. So I'm gonna find a sticker for that, I'll be right back. So these are also my stickers here that I'm using. Actually, these are some of my favorite. I like the script with just a little bit of color in there. It's like one of my favorites. So that kind of adds to this spread because it's blue. It looks really cute. All 
All right, so I'll just follow the calendar, so not terribly much, and then I'll probably pull over the tasks. Um, I do still have, I think I've got the last week in here, which I could actually do my weekly review on. So a lot of this stuff is already on my monthly, so I think what I'll do is just um, check by ink. Oh yeah. Um, because I've got all of my tasks on my monthly now. So these are my personal tasks and then my business tasks are June set up Oops. on the back of my blooms insert. So I've got business, personal, so I'll probably just pull stuff from there because I have to remember to my analytics. Um, and actually I should have had that on that calendar. Oh, it's because I didn't use the monthly calendar for, I'm using a seasons one and not... So I'm going to go analytics and budget clothes. So Thursday is going to be a big day for me because I also do my work um, plan with me on that day and then edit the video. So it's going to be a busy day, but we can do it. It's fine. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to go ahead and plan out the week now that we've checked out the tasks, we've looked at the inbox, transfer tasks, schedule week. So I'll just schedule my week and then I'll come back and look at all the tasks to be done. Now it's a matter of finding my week. I know it's under the Teresa Collins tab here. So what I will do is I'll do my meals here and I guess I'll write out my grocery list. I'll start writing it here um, as well as on my, like where I keep my grocery list is under my meals and chores and I put them here on these fold out sheets so I take these with me to the store um, but just for reference I'll have them here as well okay so this is the 29th of May to June 4th I've got this one I'll probably decorate it too I wonder if I should use pink lemonade I haven't decorated in forever I feel and then my work calendar so I know that my work calendar is not under business this is a little confusing for me. I wonder if I should, or is it under business? I don't remember. Let's see. No, it's not. Hmm. I wonder if I should switch things around. I know it's right behind the weeks here. There we go. So I'll have to refer to this, um, looking at this calendar too. It's always a pain in the butt because like it's on the back side of the monthly. So, oh well, oh well. All right, so I'm going to plan out the week here, guys. I'm gonna pull out these stickers too, in case I need them. Um, and we'll be we'll return shortly.
All right, guys, before I work on my work stuff, I just wanted to talk about this. My daughter just woke up. My husband took my son to school. My baby is still sleeping. Funny how that works. I woke up late and he's still sleeping. Um, so I just wanted to share this with you because I'm excited about it again. Um, in my Agendio inserts, I was completely functional, just writing stuff down. I didn't get to plan with stickers and I really miss it. Um, and so looking at this it makes me so happy. Yes, I overdid it. And yes, I like it. <laughs> so I used some boxes here to just kind of fill up that right side. I don't like the um, all of the labels here. So I waited out. I decorated it <laughs> so much. Um, I used a lot of washi tape here. And then I used the date labels. And then just put the main things that I know for sure that are happening. Uh, and then as I go throughout the week, I just kind of add to it. Um, so I'll probably keep the sticker book close by, if not in my planner, because it's just so big. Uh, my planner probably won't fit anything else. But um, yeah, so this is it. And normally I don't put business stuff on this one because I have my business stuff on my other um, on my other sheets, which we'll get to in a minute here. But um, I decided to put it on here anyway. And then um, just like that day, because I know that's a busy work day. I didn't put the other stuff usually. I didn't put like the daily tasks I usually do. Um, the only thing here, I forgot to put my journaling stuff. Um, I kind of consider it a work thing, but it's not really. It's, um, yeah, I wouldn't call it a work thing, but I am going to use a sticker because why not? Because we can make it look pretty. So this is kind of how I lay out my stickers. I leave room for a little icon. Um, you'll see me do this in lots of other videos and sometimes I don't use the box, the little boxes at all, but uh, I do I do like using them. Um, I know I have journaling stickers here. These are technically planning stickers. I like these plan so cute stickers. I did print these out myself um, from her website. journal day. All right. But yeah, they do kind of add a little extra something, right? So um, these are all the plan so cute stickers. They are absolutely adorable. I love them. And um, I've got a whole bunch more that I purchased because they were on sale. And I just have to cut them all. I have to finish printing them today and then I have to cut them. So that's something that I've been working on, which is not really necessary. It's not something work related. It's kind of for myself. Um, but it makes me happy. Okay, so now I need to go to my business. I'm going to quickly fast forward this. Um, and before I go any further, I forgot to write in meals here. So it's kind of been difficult to to figure out what to make. Honestly, it has. It's been a little difficult. So I think what one day we'll have sweet and sour meatballs and rice. I wouldn't mind having stew again, honestly, but that's usually like a Sunday type of meal. Um, and I think the Sunday before this is the 28th. I'm going to be making roast beef and then I'm going to invite my mom over. Okay. Um, maybe we'll do hamburger helper this day. We'll have a barbecue here. So this one, I'm going to make potato salad. That's one thing I haven't made yet. I've made macaroni salad, just not potato salad. Um, and then we'll do... Maybe we'll do lasagna again. So here's takeout. This will be lasagna. And we'll add garlic bread there. I already have two in the freezer, so I don't need to buy another one. Um, and then I haven't done pork chops and mushroom gravy yet, so I'll add that on this one. Mushroom gravy. So this week, um, currently my husband is, like he, he won't be even home tonight, so he leaves at noon, and he'll be gone all day for his grandma's funeral. And then tomorrow we have date night, so we're 
probably just going to figure out something there. So yeah, so that looks it good. And then um, on my own time, I write out, like I'll go through my pantry. Like for instance, I have garlic bread. I don't have the lasagna, so lasagna will go on the list. Um, we usually get Basili's best lasagna and it has been absolutely disgusting with no flavor, no like nothing. So we're going to see the Marie, I think it's Marie Calendar. We're going to see if that one's any better. Um, yeah, so that's it for this list. So I'll put this back in my planner. And then I'm going to tackle the work schedule for next week. And again, it will be busy because we have the first of the month. And the first of the month is always busy. Um, so right after this tab here, we'll put it back here. And then I have to open it up to this half of the work schedule here. All right, guys, so this is my setup for my work. Um, I use icons to differentiate what these things are. And this is like a kind of like a teacher layout. I got this from Fancy Plants Co. So the first one is obviously my YouTube posts. This is what actually posts to YouTube in a given week. This one is any filming or editing um, or I guess uploading that I do. So um, I always, this one's already filmed. Um, and then this one will be probably, I should probably see edit weekly update video here. Um, because I usually film that I'm going to try to go ahead, like going forward in the future, I'm going to try to film them on Saturday. So I'll edit it between Sunday, Monday. Monday is usually a pretty quiet day for me. Um, and then Oh yes, that's the other thing I did. So Monday is a journaling day, which I have down here. Um, I guess I'll continue telling you what these are first. So this is filming editing. This is anything to do with Instagram. This is to do with um, writing my blog, anything blog related. This is um, my sticker shop. And then this is technically journaling or planning, but basically anything that um, requires my attention in the in the admin field so for instance I do need to update my website I just don't know what day I'll be doing that so technically I could say Friday I could say update when's website the other thing I missed on here was under sticker shop this is my design day so I'll be designing stickers um design date and then also if i do get to designing anything i will be updating the facebook um facebook page update as well so um that's what i do there so and then if anything else comes up on the bottom row that's usually where i put all of my admin tasks so update website was on my list i know that for sure um and i can't remember if there was anything else that i had to take care of there's also um 
blog brainstorm so because that goes under blog um, I usually look to see what day I will be less busy um, usually by Friday I don't really feel like working to be quite honest um, so maybe Monday will be a good day for that let's see blog brainstorm I also um, Tuesday might be a good day for this write out write blog idea list so that's another thing that i need to do so on the back of my monthlies i have a list of like all the ideas i have a, a column entitled a blog so that's where i'm going to write down all of my new ideas so i have done already two hours of blog brainstorming from my commonplace book so i just want to write down all of those ideas and have more concrete titles of ideas for blogs um, because it's always a challenge to try to come up with new ideas so um okay so um, that is it for my work schedule and I really like these sheets I don't know they just kind of like they work so well and um, I have tried integrating my work and my my personal stuff in one calendar before and honestly guys it just doesn't seem to work very well it doesn't seem to work that well because um, yeah I don't know it's, it's just very difficult so anyway so that is it for this plan with me so thank you guys so much um honestly for me because i had lots of interruptions in this video and i will be doing fast forwarding i am now at an hour and 40 minutes into this video i'm sitting at nine o'clock my baby still hasn't woken up but i will be filming my compact video after this so this video should be pretty short for you guys because there's lots of editing that i need to do um i'm just gonna leave it open to here because that that's so satisfying for me. So thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new, please subscribe. I would love to have you join my channel and our little community here on YouTube. Last but not least, click on that bell button to be notified when I upload new content to my channel. And I'll catch you guys next week and for the same type of planning. Bye now.